Hello and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, I'm going to be going off to Leeds with my sister. Um, it's my day off for the first time in ages. So I'm filming it. We're going off to Leeds. I need to do a bit of shopping for uni, uh, a bit of clothes shopping. So that's the plan. Um, and by lunch, I'll be showing you like kind of what we're eating, kind of what we're doing. It'll be a bit chaotic because we are going with the kids. So my sister has two kids, so it's going to be a bit chaotic. But this is my outfit. So this top is from Levi's. I got it in the sale for about five pounds in an outlet. Um, these are mum jeans. I don't know if I thought them. No, can't say. Um, I mean, like just jeans, blue jeans, blue mum jeans from M and S. And when we're wearing my bands that I keep in the box, so like my blue ones. Um, and then my bag and a hoodie. So that's what I'm wearing to Leeds. Um, I've already had a coffee today in my favourite Kit Kats and mug. Always have to have coffee. Oopsies. And we're going down for breakfast now, so I'll be showing you what I'll have for breakfast. Um, so, yeah. Let's get this day started and then we'll be heading over to Leeds. The dinosaur is a social institution and not a physical reality. There is, in other words, no such thing as time. There is such a thing as rhythm. But time as such is a social institution. We did get back early, it is now half four and because we're the kids I didn't actually get that much shopping done so I'm going to have to take another trip probably to get some more stuff because I didn't get the jeans, um, I didn't get really that many, so I got two things basically but it was a really fun trip, we got some really good food as you saw, we went to Giraffe, oh, place is really good and it's not a bad price for Leeds to be honest and it's pretty decent food, we weren't there mainly because the kids menu was a lot better than most places um, so yeah but also yeah i actually got out my denim jacket that i got from uni i'll show you it not from uni i made it in my textile design for a level um so this is a denim jacket it's like an 80s kind of balloon one um i got it because i i did a whole project about re like remaking things and recycling things so, like i added uh, these flowers on and then i did this on i added all this on here did the pockets like this, I did pink on the inside and then I did this massive like, can you see? Can I go and phone up that? You can kind of see like this design on the back, that screen printer that matches and I thought I'm going to get it out and wear it it was really really comfy, my sister wasn't happy because I'm wearing double denim, double denim and she was like is this the 90s? <laughs> why are you wearing double denim? but I just fancied it and I don't have any mum jeans that are black that aren't like super super baggy that's what i'm going to be getting i think next uh, but anyway let me show you what i've got and then i will try it on and show you guys i got two things from h&m now i went in normally to like h&m stuff but they had the nfl stuff they had some things that were my, my style and i was like finally my style is kind of in and i was so happy so i got this sweatshirt it is 50 percent recycled polyester which i love um I, there was one like this and there was one a crew neck and there was one like a v-neck but i don't like v-neck thing so i've got the crew neck one and it's like this i love this sort of thing and then it's got this massive design on it which is super bowl champion 1986 chicago bears which i just love and it's got the same thing on the sleeves and on here it's not the thickest which means i can layer because a lot of my stuff I get quite thick things which makes it hard to layer but I think this would be really cool like underneath a denim layered up like just a really cool thing and it's quite long I'll try it on and I'll show you guys and then I got this now this was just by itself it is a large um, by the way that one was a medium because I didn't think I needed a large in it 
um, I'm a medium to a large it kind of depends on how I feel but I saw this now this isn't the thickest it's quite um, thin kind of see-through in the white but I thought for uni not too hot but a long sleeve with my really baggy pants it'll look quite cool um, so it's quite cropped it's long sleeve it's the green I do love like this is one of my favorite colored greens I'm trying to get my color not just black um and yeah and it's quite a the collar's not the stiffest but it's like a cropped rubber shirt this one also is 29 percent recycled cotton 42 percent recycled polyester um this was 12.99 and this was 24.99 in this which isn't too bad i don't think so but i just really liked it and i was like i really like it i'm just gonna buy it whatever so this is what it looks like it's quite cropped so if I do that it can see thing it is very very cropped it's more cropped than what I normally go for I normally wear like cropped things that come out here but I really like it I think it's really funky um I like the sleeves because it's like a long because it is long sleeve it's quite cool I like it I've been looking for some letters for ages so this is what the other jumper looks like now this is very big it is over size like let me just go up <laughs> like it's very oversized for the size this is a medium um i love it though it's not the thickest which is actually quite nice because it's so sized i'll be able to get so many layers underneath it but the sleeves are massive which i love because i like doing this hiding in myself um but i love the design of it it's quite tall as well which is really nice this is in the women's um which i'm so happy they're starting to bring this sort of stuff out for women it's quite in fashion i would probably wear it like this like the back like this um I just think it's so cool i love the design i think the design is just so cool like i love the nfl stuff they're quite a few but it's quite a bit more expensive than the normal stuff because it is nfl like i found this t-shirt i really liked for 13 quid um which isn't too bad to be honest i might go back and get something like that again i'm gonna definitely have a look online maybe go back in the store and have a proper look because i love the nfl stuff like I love stuff with just like massive designs on it and I don't really like this is like a statement piece and I can just wear just basic clothes. Um, I did go on the shopping trip for uni by the way so it's a uni clothes so this is sort of stuff I'd be wearing in uni just big baggy comfortable but like semi fashionable in a way but I'm still comfy. Comfort is key for myself. Um, I also love this because it kind of hides. I like to hide myself in clothes um, so this is kind of perfect for that but it still looks really cool. I feel cool in this like this with a pair of converse like blue jeans like this pair of converse or vans and just outfit sorted um so yeah this amazing so glad i paid for this like i was gonna leave it because i knew my parents would hate it and then i was just like no nah, i'm gonna get it i love this too much it's too cool to leave behind so i'm joining my parents going up to the quiz tonight so it's a bit of going to the quiz having a bit of fun but i want to be comfy but i also want to wear this so i'm in the same jeans as before i'm probably going to put on high top vans just because my other vans are put away and i can't be bothered and i'm putting i put on this top oh, i love it it looks so nice and it's just comfy but looks quite cool and then i fresh washed my hair this morning so this is kind of my hair just natural after being blow dried um i do have these little bits that frame my face i'm growing them out though because I don't like them anymore <laughs> um, I think this needs to be a bit longer but yeah this is what I outfit I'm wearing tonight um, yeah I love this so much I really I want more stuff like this um, so but because night tonight so I'll try and show you a little bit but I don't know I'll try but it's that time again with editing town win because I always forget to finish videos that was kind of my day it was more like a day in the life than a food video because we didn't actually get that much food and i completely forgot to show my tea and i didn't have breakfast so it's more of like a what i what i like a day video than a food video but the food was so good i'm gonna go there more often um because it wasn't that badly priced for these and it was pretty decent there was a lot of kids there and i think that's because of the kids menu but it was really good for the kids and it was just really nice so i think we might be going there more often as well if we ever have the kids in Leeds 
but yeah it was such a fun day it was really really fun didn't get that much shopping done but then again it was kind of difficult but you know what can you do i'm going to be going back again very very soon to film some more fun fun videos i have planned so you'll be seeing a lot more vlogs with leads in it a lot more food videos just because why not um i also need to go shopping for clothes anyway so i might as well do two in one um so yeah i hope you liked this video if you did please can you give it a thumbs up comment down below something fun that you've done this weekend and click the subscribe button to be to be not to be subscribed to my channel where we do a lot of food videos especially with uni coming up at the end of this month there's going to be a lot lot more more food videos that are fun because my friend Freya is coming up as well from well she's coming down to look from the lakes which means i'll be actually seeing more people i'll be doing more fun things there'll be a lot more fun content come in so be sure for that to be ready for uni vlogs to be starting again because i have missed doing them so much but this time they'll be more food related so it should be really really fun click the notification bell to be notified every time i do upload i upload on a saturday at 5 p.m uk time so please be notified every time that i do upload and i'll see you guys next time in my next video